Good morning class and welcome to Game Dev Academy. It's that magical time again where Epic refreshes the free content on the Epic Marketplace. In this video we'll take a look at what's on offer this month and everything will be linked in the description just below that like button. First up this month we have this very beautiful looking log cabin environment from Gabro Media. This is a small but atmospheric and very detailed environment featuring a fully furnished interior. There are 80 high quality props that can be used in this or any other environment. The detailed models hold up to even close up rendering and the pack even includes particle and audio effects. I think this environment looks amazing so make sure you snap it up whilst it's free. Also free this month is the modular snap system by Unigames. This is an editor plugin that makes it easy to snap and align objects together in UE4 by simply moving them close together. This is an excellent solution for working with modular assets and means that you don't have to worry about the grid or pivot points. It works with any actor that has static mesh, skeletal mesh or spline components. It'll work with existing assets that you have, you just need to add sockets and you're ready to go. Next up we have Train Yard by Volodymyr Stepaniuk. This is another amazing environment and is based on a post-Soviet train yard environment. Among the included assets are modular trains, complete with interiors, modular buildings, background buildings, props and decals. All of the assets in this pack have been created with current gen budgets in mind so you can drop these into your game project without having to worry too much about performance. I got hold of this pack for the train interiors alone, everything else was just a nice little bonus. Fourth on our list is VFX Attack Trails by Unforgiven. This descriptively named asset pack does exactly as its name promises. It adds some very cool looking trails to your attack animations. This can bring a real level of polish and professionalism to your work. Included in the pack, you'll get 24 effects, 17 textures and 27 materials. The developer has also promised to add two more effects when the pack reaches 80 and then 150 ratings on the Epic Marketplace. Rounding up the free monthly content this time is Volumetric Glass by Christian Komisarek. What this asset offers is an advanced and efficient master material which is designed for rendering volumetric shapes and glass. You might find this useful for creating sci-fi stylized environments like water tanks, aquariums and underwater tunnels. The emphasis here is on efficiency and this material is suitable for use on both mobile and VR platforms. The material is very customizable with over 70 parameters for you to tweak to your liking such as light shafts, scattering, glass colour and reflections. Speaking from experience, I know that creating high quality glass that doesn't hit the GPU too hard can be a challenge, so I definitely recommend picking this one up this month. That covers all of the content that will be free all of November, but we're not done yet as Epic has also added two more assets to their permanently free collection. The first of these is the Easy Ballistics plugin made by Mookie. This plugin includes features including simulation of gravity, dragon wind, ricochets, wall penetration and ballistic curves and the developer even offers an example project and tutorial playlist to get you started. The second asset to become permanently free this month is military style mannequins from Offworld Defense Simulations. Based on the standard UE4 mannequin, this is an expanded set of mannequins for prototyping which includes military and normal skins as well as dedicated female animations. That's it for this month's free UE4 Marketplace content. All of the products featured are linked below, so go and fill your vault while the price is right. If you liked this video, make sure you smash that thumbs up button and subscribe to Game Dev Academy for more tutorials to help you learn to make games. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.